Hey everyone, it's Matt aka Tech Ranger, and today we are going to take a look at the alternate start Live Another Life mod, and it's it's a smaller mod, but it's actually got a lot to it. There's a lot of different things that you can do at the start of the game with this mod, and all you have to do is interact with the statue, you pick some options, and you can go on your merry way, start your own Skyrim adventure, and do whatever you really want. We're going to go through all the different options here, and in this first video, we're going to look at the first two major options, and then go through and look at all the branches off of those, and in the next video, we'll look at some more. If that is something you guys are interested in, stick around. I'll try to put as many timestamps in the description down below, because this is one of my, probably one of my longest videos, and the next one is probably going to be just as long, if not longer so I definitely want to make it easy for people to kind of find what they need rather than have to watch the entire video I mean if you want then you can obviously I'm not gonna say you shouldn't but thank you so much for watching let's go ahead and jump into the mod so after you download the mod go ahead and start a new game like you would if you were just starting a new fresh playthrough and the first thing you're gonna see is the character selection screen so go ahead and set up your character as usual rather than going to Helgen being taken prisoner and then you kind of go through that deal where they're like hey what's your name and then you go in the character selection there this is just at the start and then this is going to put you right into a dungeon and then in that dungeon there's gonna be this statue Approach, my child, and choose where your new life shall begin. And this statue is going to give you all of the options that you can use in order to start your next playthrough. And then all you need to do is go sleep in the bed behind you, and then you'll be loaded into your next adventure. So to show you exactly where you would get off of the ship, if you pick the first option, you know, we're going to be going to Solitude, Dawnstar, Winterhold, and Solzheim if you have the DLC, the Dragonborn DLC. Obviously, you leave the ship at the shipyard of whatever hold you're in, but it is good to kind of see exactly where you're going to be if you're downloading this mod for the first time and have no idea what you should pick you know where you're going to get dropped off and then you also know kind of what's going to be in your inventory they give you kind of a general theme of items usually you have a weapon and some clothes and some rings and then that'll be enough to kind of get you on your merry way and then go to wherever you want to next i'm gonna let the rest of this play out and then i'll chime back in at option two when we get to the next phase of the living of the life mod <laughs> So option two is going to see you owning a house or property in one of the major holds. There's several different options. So we're just going to go through each one and show you each house and kind of the general like consensus of what's in it. And then just kind of the general items that are in the house. They're kind of all pretty similar in terms of like what you get at the start. And honestly, this out of the two so far, I think this is probably the best option if you want like a really good start to your game where you have some things to kind of mess around with. Like you saw some dwarven stuff in the beginning of this house. And that is kind of the same for the others as well. And some money here and there and some items. But it's nothing like major, but it's a good start if you just want that little push and whereas the first option is more of like hey take me somewhere and this is where I'm gonna start
If you happen to watch this entire video, thank you so much for watching. I just kind of wanted to show all that this mod had to offer as in a raw format as possible rather than me just kind of talking over every single option. This way someone can come to the channel, see the video, and jump to a timestamp and get somewhere where they need to be in the video and then be on their merry way. So that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like if you haven't already and I'll catch y'all in the next video. Thanks for watching.